Hey guys, it is PressGHD back, and today we have another overpowered class setup. And like usual, we will be going over the stats of the gun first to see what attachments can make it go from a COD gun to a God gun. But before we go over this, I would like to thank my friend Andrew, aka Monster Clash, who has been in some of my previous videos, for helping me find out some of the stats for today's video. Anyways, welcome to this channel if you are new, and welcome back if you are not. And I'm sorry about not posting a video in the past few days. I have been sick for almost the past week and it's not getting any better, but I'm pulling through it for you guys. Now today the gun we'll be going over is the CUDA. Now the CUDA is by far, I feel like, one of the most underrated SMGs in the game. Most people like the Weevil, most people like the BMP. This is honestly my favorite submachine gun in the game. Now one of the things that makes the CUDA so special is its damage profile. The CUDA will deal four different damages. It'll deal 35 at close range, 30 at medium range, 23 at long range, and at its maximum range or very long range it'll deal 19. What this means is is that the CUDA will take anywhere from three to six shots to kill but your lucky number is four. Most of the time it'll only take four and now let's get on to the ranges for these numbers. The three shot kill range is five meters, which is less than shotgun range and closer to barrel stuffing. But the CUDA makes up for this with its four and five shot kill range. Its four shot kill range will be 25 meters, which is higher than average for submachine guns, and its five shot kill range is 50 meters, also being higher than average for submachine guns. Now onto the headshot multiplier. The CUDA does 1.1 times regular damage when it's getting when getting a headshot, meaning it is useless at close to medium range, but will make up for it with one less shot at long ranges. The rounds per minute or RPM for the CUDA is 720 RPM. Moving on to the time to kill, when using the CUDA you will find out that it is very competitive at close ranges and also does well at longer ranges. The accuracy is decent but not the best. When I was testing the recoil, the CUDA's bullets always went straight up and to the right. So it is predictable and fixable. And it also has a good standard hip fire spread. You will hear standard quite a bit. The aim down sights time will also be standard for submachine guns, taking 200 milliseconds to aim. The two things, though, that the CUDA excel at are its wall penetration factor and its reload time. The CUDA has a wall penetration factor that is equal to an assault rifles, making it high. The reload time for the CUDA holds second place in Black Ops 3 for reload time. The CUDA reloads at a speed of 1.8 seconds. And now that we're done with the stats, it's time for attachments. The first attachment will be foregrip to tighten up the bullet spread because like I said before, the accuracy isn't the best. Now for the second attachment, you'll want stock because stock for some reason on submachine guns is like a god attachment. It pretty much doubles your maneuverability making you like a cloud on a map. Anyways, um, for the last attachment, you can choose between extended mags because it does hold second place for reload time and it honestly having extended mags with that reload time is insane or you can choose long barrel because like I said before the three shot kill range is very 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 bad um, but y you may not need that and then that's it pretty much yeah so thank you for watching this videos guys uh these video oh my gosh anyways sorry about that um that's the first fuck up i think i've done 
anyways thank you for watching this video guys you guys are amazing I love my viewers like usual guys stay golden all right I am out see you guys peace